So now this is one of those things that I haven't seen that many uh, reviews online about. And I think this is one of the best things that Toyota has for their cars. Now, the whole year I've used this vehicle, I don't know what I would have done if I didn't have this. Now, there's a, the remote start services that you do have on Toyota. Uh, they allow you to turn on and off your car via your phone, unlock and lock your car. But there's things that they don't tell you that I will tell you right now. First of all, I don't know if all the, the RAV4s have Wi-Fi, but this one has Wi-Fi hotspot. What that allows you to do is you could have any, um, like a tablet or anything that for your kids in the back and whatnot. They could hook up to your Wi-Fi on your car, right? And it allows them to use the internet. Cool, right? But the, what Toyota doesn't tell you is that via that hotspot or via that internet connection, they are monitoring your car. Ain't that a thing? So here, I'll tell you how this is known. They know where you parked your car, your last location. They have they seen your recent trips, where you go, where where have you been? And they even tell you, hey, your vehicle requires uh, a scheduled maintenance, right? So let's say you have to uh, create a, a maintenance, right? A schedule of maintenance. Here you could do that from your phone, which is crazy. Um, it also gives you your driver score, which is one of those things that I'm like, how the heck do they know this? All right, let's learn more. Now, Toyota is saying that I have a score of 96. I think that's pretty good, right? One fast acceleration, 19 harsh cornerings. So they know what I'm doing with the car. They know that I'm doing harsh cornerings. Four harsh brakings. The disclosure says the driver score and trip information are based on the behavior of the driver of your vehicle. Driver score, driving behavior, and trip information are for your information only and not shared with any third party, which I'm just breaking that disclosure right now, for its own purpose without your express consent. But they don't tell you that they're monitoring, monitoring your car. They're not telling you that they're, hey, we know, we know what you're doing. We know that you're accelerating the car. We know that you're taking crazy corners and that you are breaking your car really hard. Now, let's continue on with most of the things that you got here. Now, Toyota gives you the, the odometer. They do show you how, ma how many miles are in the odometer, which I could say they're, they're pretty on spot right here. Mine says 10, 5, 20. App is saying that I have 10, 5, 19. It is saying 280 miles to empty, and they give you a nice little picture of your car. Now, if you click your car, it will give you an update about your vehicle. It will tell you if your doors are closed, locked, and everything is good. Like if your hood, your moonroof, and your hatch is open or closed. I think that's pretty neat about Toyota, right? Status if it's red, that means that something is wrong. If it's green, that means that it's good to go. And right here, you could start and turn and uh, start your engine, turn it off, unlock and lock your car. Now, this is one of those things that people don't know, and or they do know, but they don't take advantage of. Now, I've read somewhere that uh, Toyota, the only way they could do this if, is if you have your internet connection activated. But I don't know. I think they're pretty. That pretty much they that, that thing is also activated on their, their end, and they. They could, they could, they know what you're doing to your car. So, with that being said, is this your car really, or does Toyota have all the the, the power to, or all the uh, authority over your car? I mean, for all I know, they they could probably be listening to what I'm saying right now, because they do have the SOS up here, and they do have the uh, little mic where they talk to you. That to me is crazy that they have this much information on your about your car, which to me also is a good thing, right? But they do have your personal info and all the, all that good stuff. So there you have it. That's one of those things that I wanted to show you that Toyota has for this vehicle. I think it's only on the Antune 3.0 system. And crazy how they uh, know where your car is and all that. And the driver score.